Hi everyone, it's Kim from Affordably Crafty and today I have a haul from the three Michael stores and one Joann's that I went to today um, and everything, well, everything except for one thing was on clearance um, <clears throat> including some Amora hooks and some yarn at 90% off so if you're new here, hi, my channel is all about stretching your craft dollar and learning how to be affordably crafty. Um, I also am going to be linking down below my 500 subscriber giveaway video. Um, go check that out and comment. My drawing is on the 31st, um, so you don't want to miss that. And I will also be announcing my next contest during that video on July 31st, so check that out. Um, and so like subscribe share with your friends um join my facebook group and let's get into this haul so i went to michael's to check out the yarn clearance now i was there a couple weeks ago and i wasn't very impressed with the prices i'm gonna be honest with you um but i did get a couple of good hits today when i was there um oh today's 7 27 2020 just so you know Okay, let's get into this haul. So let's start with a yarn that I got on clearance that was a oopsie from one of the employees. So this skein of Charisma Tweed Hues by Loops and Threads in these nice brown colors. Um, it's in the colorway. Does it have a name? Uh, wood grain. Well, that, that is definitely a good name for that. That looks like a wood grain. So this is supposed to be $4.49, which as you can see clearly here on the tag, the regular price is, sorry, something in my eye, is $4.49, and it's on clearance for $1.47. No, it's not. That was a mislabel. So I had picked this up because I like the colorway, and I thought that was a decent price. Um, this is 97% acrylic and 3% viscose, and that's the little tweedy bits here. A little tweed bit coming off. So, and they honored the clearance sticker since I got pretty much everything else in my basket was on clearance. So, and this wasn't the first Michaels I was at. So, I got four of these. Um, these were all mismarked at 147. Hmm. And these are a bulky five. Um, and they are machine washable, so that's pretty awesome and dryable. But I'm thinking that these are going to become maybe a hat and scarf if I have enough yards because there's a hundred and nine yards, so I might have enough for a hat and a small scarf. What do you think? It's like 440 yards. Hmm. I'll have to see what I can do. So that was the first clearance yarn. Um, then I got a clover accessory, a craft thing that I haven't seen before. Um, so they had this flower loom, which I guess the normal price is $20.99. No, I'm not paying that much for that. And you can see it makes flowers there. So I got it for $8.99 just because I wanted to try it and I thought it would be something maybe my daughter would enjoy. And it's got a bunch of different sizes in it and has instructions. So I'm going to do a review on this. Um, I have quite a few things, little gadgets in my craft area that I need to explore and do some reviews on. So I'm going to be doing that in August. I haven't really used Susan Bates hooks before. Um, and I thought that this price I couldn't go wrong. So these were 90% off for a four hook set. It's normally $15.99 and I got them for $1.59. And these are a 2.75, 3.25, 3.5, and a 3.75 pack aluminum hooks. That's a C, D, E, and F in the United States. So this is what they look like. Now I have been getting into some thread crochet recently and some lower weights. Um, I'm always drawn to a four weight, but I have been doing a little bit more with a two, one, and some thread stuff. Um, so these smaller sizes will be useful, but I was happy to find those at 90% off. That was at the second store. No, hold on. Those were at the, yeah, the, 
nope. Third store I went to. So the Susan Bates hooks were at the third store. The Charisma Tweeds were at the first. The Flower Loom was at the third store I went to. Okay, so I get kind of a lot of this novelty yarn because I'm going to be turning it into a rug. Bigger rug down here for the den room where the fireplace is. That's this room here. And then a small rug or pillow, I'm not really sure, in my daughter's room. Um, so this was also 90% off. So this normally was... Let me get one that has a... Can I have one with a price tag, please? This is normally $7.99. Now, on the tag, it says $2.97. It was on an end cap that said 80% off, but when I scanned it, it was actually 90% off. So these were $0.79 cents a skein, and that's the Lion brand, that 70s yarn. Um, and this is one of the colors that I'm going to be making into a rug for down here. I like the fall of this, the fall of this English. It's a very autumnal colorway. It's got, like, olive green, cream, a little bit of orange, and some dark brown. And this is in the color... Jagadelic, and I got 14 in this colorway, and then to be complimentary, oh sorry, 15 in this colorway, I also got some of the groovy style, so I thought these would look good together, maybe I'll trim it in this, I don't, don't really know what I'm going to do yet, but I got one, two, seven of this. So, it doesn't have a lot of yardage in each one. It's 38 yards, 95% acrylic, 5% polyester, and it's a super bulky 6. Machine wash, lay flat to dry. Um, yeah, so it's not a lot of yardage. So, I got, at the three stores I went to, I got all of these and all of these. Um, and then for the one near my daughter's bed, like a little throw rug, I only found five of this kind. And it is in the colorway Good Vibes. But look at how cool that is. It reminded me of a unicorn. That's why I got it. So yeah, it's got this like uh, turquoise, aqua kind of color, a like mulberry, kind of a grapey color, and this like pink, light pink color. But yeah, I thought that that, that kind of reminded me of a unicorn. I got five of those for my daughter's room. Those were 90% off, too, and that was awesome. They had other different colorways there. Um, just always, you know, when you go get clearance, take it and scan it at the scanner because a lot of times it's mismarked. Maybe they missed that skein. You know, it can really help to make good decisions for what you're buying. Um, so now I'm going to go to the two things that I got at Joann's. So I stopped at one Joann's because I wasn't going to make it to the fourth um, Michaels I wanted to go to before they closed. So I got this boy finger guide to try that I used my 40% off coupon on. So it says it's on clearance. It was $4.99, but they let me use a coupon on it, so I'm not really sure what happened there. Um, but it's got three different size guides on it, and then this right here is flexible. So I think that'll be comfortable. And you just click in the different guides, so they have one for lightweight medium and bulky yarn um so i'm gonna give this a try and review it and see how that goes and then i also got a little package of safety eyes because i'm gonna try doing some amigurumi for the first time i didn't want to go crazy and buy a humongous thing off amazon before i knew if i was really going to be into this um so I'm going to be trying some of the amigurumi from the Harry Potter crochet kit that I uh, unboxed. I'll link that down below, too. Um, since July 31st is a very important day, it's Harry Potter's birthday. So I am going to be working on some of that Harry Potter amigurumi in August. Um, so that was my little Joann's. They had some clearance here on there, but... So it was not really good selection. It was pretty much just that loop stuff that I hate. The Crayola off the hook and then some blanket yarn. No thank you. Um, 
so now I'm going to go to the last jar, and then I'll talk about my clovers. So, I was, the first one really had the best yarn selection that I went to. Um, there are two other ones that I may try going to later this week when I have a babysitter. Um, one in my town and one a couple towns over. Those are the next two closest to me. We'll see. Um, but this is Snugly Stripes Wool by Loops and Threads. And it was $8.99. And I got it for 89 cents. And it's the colorway that I really like. I didn't just buy it because it was 89 cents. Um, so it's in the colorway Forever Green. And this is what it looks like, guys. It's really pretty. Like, I am very happy with that color. Green is my second favorite color after purple. So that's awesome. Now, I don't do a lot of work with one weight. So this is going to... I'm going to have to find, like, a really nice shawl pattern for this. It's a one super fine, 75% wool, 25% nylon. A 3.25 millimeter hook. So I have a 3.25 in this. Yep. So I have a Susan Bates, one, a Susan Bates one I can try with this. And it's got 434 yards in it. So I was lucky. And I got all of them that they had. And I think it's a decent amount. I got five. Whoopsie, there goes one. I'm going to have to do a little Ravelry um, look. If you have any suggestions for an interesting shawl that I can use with this one weight yarn, let me know. Give me a link down, drop a link down below if you have something that you use. Um, now let's get to the clovers. Dun, 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 dun. So I bought all of the clover hooks they had on clearance. Now these were buried under a bunch of like Michael's brand um, knitting needles with the, the cable between it. I don't knit, so whatever those are called. Um, and then they had some big um, loops and threads, like really big ones on clearance, um, like plastic ones. But I had all the sizes already that were on clearance. I had gotten the biggest one, like, the last time I was at the store, two weeks ago. It was the same price as it was then. And buried under all those was these beautiful Clover Amours. So this is the first time <clears throat> that I've ever gotten Clover Amours. <clears throat> and I actually just started using it in the Afghan I'm working for on my couch. Working for, for my new couch. Well, new to me. We got it from the Restore for Habitat for Humanity um, this past weekend. And it... I'm using a 10 millimeter hook with um, Woolies Thick and Quick. So I got two of these 10 millimeter Amores, Clover Amores, and they are originally $11.99 and they are four, marked down to $4.97. I don't think you can read that price tag, maybe now. Sorry, $4.77. Um, so I get two of these with the thought of this being part of a giveaway in the future. And then there was one. 12 millimeter hook that normal price did a normal price was 12.49 and it was on sale for or on clearance for 4.97 so that's a 12 millimeter hook <clears throat> and then there was a 15 millimeter hook um normal price 13.49 and i got it for 5.37 so i also got two of these that's what they had so one of these is going to go in a future giveaway um, but I tend to work with four, five, and six yarn, so actually these bigger hooks are great. Um, yeah, so I'm super excited about that. Um, let me know again in the comments down below what I should make with this one weight wool, mostly wool yarn that I have like five times 435 yards of. Um, and let me know if anybody has used this flower loom before from Clover and how you feel about it. I will post my shop with me uh, walkthrough video of the clearance um, tomorrow. Um, and then I have some more videos this week about my wrap up of Yarny Yule Summer Edition. And I will, you know, click on the 500 subscriber giveaway. And so you can enter, comment, like, enter, subscribe, and see that giveaway on the 31st. All right. Everybody have a very creative day. Bye-bye.